फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट काइंडली प्रोवाइड द सर्टिफाइड जीरोक्स कॉपीज ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस सर्टिफिकेट्स ऑफ ऑल द कैंडिडेट्स कोल्ड फॉर द इंटरव्यू ऑन सिक्सटींथ मार्च टू थाउजेंड टेन हु हैव क्लेम्ड द एक्सपीरियंस इन द रेलिवेंट फील्ड एज पर रिकॉर्ड्स अवेलेबल इन द यू पी एस सी एंड एज मैंशनड बाय द कैंडिडेट्स एट सीरियल नंबर टेन बी ऑफ पार्ट वन ऑफ देयर एप्लीकेशन हु आर कोल्ड फॉर द इंटरव्यू हेल्ड ऑन सिक्सटींथ मार्च टू थाउजेंड टेन The Central Information Commission directed the petitioner UPSC to supply the aforesaid information. Being aggrieved from the direction given by the commission, the petitioner filed WP Civil Number three three six five of two thousand eleven, which came to be dismissed by a learned single judge of this court. The appeal filed by the UPSC. Also came to be dismissed by a division bench of this court. Being still aggrieved, the petitioner filed the forced appeal by way of special leave. Allowing the appeal filed by the UPSC, the apex court inter alia held as under, relying upon its earlier decision in Bihar School Examination Board. वर्सेज सुरेश प्रसाद सिन्हा टू थाउजेंड नाइन एट एस सी सी फोर एटी थ्री वन ऑफ द ड्यूटीज ऑफ द फ्यूडिशरी इज टू मेक थ्रू डिस्कलोजर ऑफ ऑल द रेलिवेंट फैक्ट्स ऑफ ऑल ट्रांजेक्शन्स बिटवीन दैम टू द बेनिफिशरी इन ए फ्यूडिशरी रिलेशनशिप बाय दैट लॉजिक द एग्जामिनिंग बॉडी इफ इट इज इन ए fiduciary relationship with an examinee will be liable to make a full disclosure of the evaluated answer books to the examinee and at the same time owe a duty to the examinee not to disclose the answer books to anyone else if a entrust a document or an article to be to be processed on completion of processing b is not accept, expected to give the document or article to anyone else but is bound to give the same to a who entrusted the document or article to b for processing therefore if a relationship of fiduciary and beneficiary is assumed between the examining body and the examinee with reference to the answer book section 81 e would operate as an exemption to prevent access to any third party and will not operate as a bar for the very person who wrote the answer book seeking inspection or disclosure of it the apex court held that the commission committed a serious illegality by directing the upsc to disclose the information at points 4 and 5 and the high court also committed an error by approving the said order it was noted that neither the cic nor the high court recorded a finding that disclosure of the aforesaid information relating to other candidates was necessary to larger public interest and therefore the case was not covered by the exception carved out in section 81e of the RTI act in the case before this court no finding has been recorded by the commission that it was in the larger public interest to disclose the information with respect to the qualification and experience of other shortlisted candidates in the absence of recording such a finding the commission could not have directed 
disclosure of the aforesaid information to the respondent in the present case the information such as date of birth institution and year of passing graduation field experiences and caste is personal information of the selected candidates there is no finding by the commission that it was in larger public interest to disclose the aforesaid personal information of the recommended candidates even in his application seeking information the respondent did not claim that any larger public interest was involved in disclosing the aforesaid information in the absence of such a claim in the application and a finding to this effect by the commission no direction for disclosure of the aforesaid personal information could have been given for the reasons stated here in above the impugned order dated 7th june 2010 passed by the central information commission is hereby set aside the writ petition stands disposed of no order as to cause stop